I am presenting polymorphic GAN, generating aligned samples across multiple domains with learned morph maps. I'm Seng, and this is a joint work with Karsten, Daiching, Antonio, and Sanya. Nowadays, generative models like StyleGAN can generate impressive, high-quality images. The question is, can they also generate aligned samples across multiple related domains? By aligned, I mean samples that have common attributes, like the pose of the faces, as shown here at the bottom. And why is this an important question? There are multiple reasons. First, obtaining a paired dataset, such as a pair of synthetic and real driving scenes, is a non-trivial task, but they are required for many real-world problems, such as autonomous driving research. Also, once we have a way of generating aligned samples, we can easily transfer attributes from one domain to another. For example, we can edit an image in one domain and make the corresponding changes in all other domains. Lastly, many deep learning models benefit from feature sharing for related tasks, and we believe generative models also should benefit from it. Now, one of the challenges for modeling multiple domains is that they could have distinct geometries, such as human and animal faces, and we want to align them with common attributes. To tackle the challenge, our model produces aligned samples by explicitly learning the geometric differences between domains and sharing generator features. We start from a pre-trained StyleGAN model that already produces good samples in one parent domain. StyleGAN generates features at multiple resolutions, denoted as U here, and these features go through some convolution layers to produce the output. Now, to produce an aligned sample from a new domain, we reuse the StyleGAN features and train MorphNet, which produces a 2D offset map that specifies how the features should be geometrically modified to be suitable for the new domain. With this morph map, we morph the features and train a new shallow ConvNet to render the features for the new domain, and the output is fed into a new discriminator. We can simultaneously train multiple domains using the same process, resulting in our polymorphic GAN that produces aligned samples. Therefore, polymorphic GAN learns the geometric differences through the MorphNet, and this ensures that we can effectively share the same generator features for multiple domains. Once our model is trained, we can use it for many interesting applications. For edit transfer, we use existing algorithms for finding image editing vectors, such as object rotation in style and slate and space. Each row here is one aligned sample for five different domains, sedan, truck, SUV, sports car, and van. Because all domains share the same generator features, we can transfer the editing vector found in the main generator to all domains. Our model produces explicit 2D morph maps that modifies the feature maps, and we can directly use them for transferring segmentation masks. We first run a segmentation model on the parent domain, and then use the morph maps to modify the segmentation map for each domain, giving us zero shadow ability to obtain a segmentation for other domains. Polymorphic GAN essentially disentangles the geometric differences from texture differences between domains, and this enables novel image editing applications. We can use the fixed morph map from one domain while using rendering layers from another domain, for example, to create a cat-shaped tiger or a tiger-shaped human. We can also go in the other direction, where we fix the rendering layers and only exchange the morph maps. And here are examples of how we can change a sports car to a van or a van to a truck. For faces, we can, for example, make a tiger to be human-shaped. We can see how polymorphic and successfully learned the geometric characteristics of each domain. Please visit us to have more discussions and thank you for listening.